Love knocked at my door, poked her head in and said, hello. She offered that we paint words in the colors of love and then paint us in the colors of love. In short, she said, let's make love. And who oh, we did. I made love to love at first. I couldn't stop. Weeks became months and I couldn't wait to stop. Move closer. Steady your heart. Pay attention. Attend your ears as I bleed the reasons for my desperation. On this faithful day, the day I became faithful, love was staring at my face. We were enjoying the after sex phase, but I didn't know that love was too faced. She claimed I was too innocent. He said, love stole my heart and beat and in pieces. She returned it to me, broken into pieces. Love said she's no longer interested, that we are now history together. She sat me down as we studied our history together. I mean, it's amazing that now I have to study history to get her. So sometimes, when love knocks, she comes with fruit that reminds you of your greatest fantasies she reminds you the reason why you've always had a weakness for fantasies other times when love knocks she comes out in seeds of deceitfulness it doesn't take you long before you decipher she's only here for your seed both the ones you passionately plant and the ones she eats sometimes when love knocks it comes with gifts care, affection, and all those sweet things that make your spirit lit. Other times, when love knocks, it comes with truth, quoted lies, is funny, a pro at throwing those playful bands. It doesn't take long before you decipher. It's only doing that to shift your part. So when love knocks, open the door. Enjoy your love sessions and all the Chris, but don't forget, she can be two-faced. When love knocks, probably you should just ask, are you going to last in bed or are you here for a quickie?